What will the future of the Kenyan-led mission in Haiti look like? The United States of America and Ecuador circulated a draft resolution on Friday which would extend the mandate of the mission until October 2025, while the UN plans a transition to a peacekeeping force. The mission has seen almost 400 Kenyan police deploy since June. The multinational force should eventually consist of 2,500 personnel. Peacekeeping operations are funded from a special UN budget, unlike the Kenya-led mission, which has been mostly financed by the US and Canada. If the proposed Security Council resolution mentions gains made by the UN-backed multinational mission, gangs are still powerful. Haiti last week expanded its state of emergency to cover the whole country. The last UN peacekeeping operation in Haiti left in 2017. It was blamed for dumping infected sewage into a river, causing a deadly cholera outbreak. An internal UN report found that at least 134 UN peacekeepers exploited Haitian children in a sex ring.